Hello developers, in this video tutorial I am going to teach you how to run python program .py files in windows operating system using various applications and methods such as command prompt, IDLE, python application and visual studio code. Ok, let's see how to run python program in windows operating system. First I am going to check whether the python is successfully installed or not on my operating system. For that I am opening command prompt. Then using this command python space hyphen hyphen version you can check whether the python is installed or not. You can see that it returns the output as python 3.10.0. This is the python version. It means python is successfully installed on my operating system. Okay. Let's see how to run python.py files. First I am going to use python application. When I type python you can find that uh, python application is showing. I just open the python application. Then I am going to print a simple message. So I am using print welcome. When I click enter you can see that it uh, returns the output. right? In this way you can run uh, python codes using python application. The second method is IDLE. When you type IDLE, you can find the IDLE application, Python application. Just to open that. In this shell, you can uh, run the Python codes directly like uh, the Python application. For example, I'm going to type print welcome to coding diksha. When I hit enter, you can see that it returns the output welcome to code in Diksha. In this shell, you can run the Python codes, but uh, if you want to uh, save the file as .py, then you have to uh, click file, then new file. Otherwise, you can use the shortcut control plus n. It opens the new shell. Now, I'm going to get the input from the user. For that, I'm going to use name equal to input enter your name then i'm going to display the message using print hello then name okay now i'm going to save this file for that uh, i'm clicking file then save otherwise you can use the shortcut control plus yes I'm going to save the file in desktop main.py. You can use uh, any other file name you want instead of main, but the extension must be .py. Click save. You can run this uh, Python code uh, by clicking the run and the run module option. Otherwise, you can directly uh, hit the F5 button to run the Python program. You can see that it is uh, opening the python program in new shell. It is asking enter your name. I am going to type my name Ranjit. When I hit enter, it is displaying the output. Hello Ranjit, right? By using this method, you can run uh, python program in IDLE shell. That's it. Now I am going to show you uh, how to run python.py files in Visual Studio Code because a lot of people is using Visual Studio Code as a code editor. So I am opening Visual Studio Code. I am just closing the project folder I have already worked. Yep. Now I am going to open the project folder which I have already created for Python projects. As you can see that there are no files inside this folder. Okay. Now I'm going to create a new file, click file and new file, otherwise uh, use the shortcut control plus n. Then save the file as app.py or any other name, whatever you want. But don't forget to choose save as type as all files and the extension must be .py. Yeah, I successfully saved the file. Now I'm going to uh, get the input from the username equal to input enter your name 
then I'm going to print welcome name yeah. that's it just uh, click the terminal and new terminal option it will open the project directory uh, terminal you can see that uh, I'm using Python uh, folder for uh, the Python projects so it is opening the project directly correctly otherwise you have to use the cd command to navigate to the directory otherwise the python command will not work just type python space app.py the file name right when i click enter you can see that it is asking enter your name i am inputting my name you can see that uh, it returns the output welcome ranjit um, in visual studio code there is a extension called python you can find it here it is very useful to uh, align the codes and uh, for uh, many futures when you install the application when you right click on the text editor you can find the option run python file in terminal when you click that it will automatically run that uh, python uh, program in terminal you can see that it is asking the input from the user run this yeah in this way also you can run the python program in visual studio code that's it otherwise you can use the notepad to uh, create and run the python programs notepad now i'm going to uh, type my uh, python codes name equal to input double quotation enter your name print double quotation hello then name i am going to save this file in music folder don't forget to uh, choose save as type as all files then the file name index.py that's it i successfully saved or oh, instead of equal i used the hyphen yeah i saved the file You can see that index.py is uh, showing on the music folder. Just navigate to the directory, then click here, then type cmd, then hit enter. It will automatically open the command prompt on the directory. Then just type python space, then the file name. I saved the file as index.py, so I'm using index.py here. When I hit enter, you can see that it, it is asking uh, my name, enter your name, Ranjit. When I hit enter, it returns the output, hello Ranjit. That's it guys. Uh, in this method, you can run the python program.py files using command prompt cmd. I hope this video helps you to uh, run python program files on Windows 10 operating system or any other Windows operating system such as Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 8.1. Still, if you face any issues, then don't uh, worry, feel free and uh, leave a comment. We will help you. If you want to receive more Python videos, then don't forget to subscribe this channel.